Hi, this is Dan with Elisis. I'm here to show you the brand new drum module that's coming with our Forge and Command electronic drum kits. This is a brand new module for Elisis. It comes with over 600 brand new sounds, over 70 drum kits, and over 60 play along songs, as well as a few other features as well, which I'm gonna show you right now. So let's take a closer look. All of the modes you're gonna be using most of the time have one button with them. The kit mode you'll be spending most of your time with and you simply press the button and then scroll with the scroll wheel here to select your kit. If you want to change the song that you're playing along with, you just press the song button and scroll to choose from one of the 60 songs that are in here. And then just press the start stop button to play them. The click can be turned on just by pressing the button once and you'll get visual feedback here as well as a menu that gives you the choice of time signature, volume, interval, sound, and output, which actually lets you change the metronome going to the main output, the headphone output, or both, which is very useful. All right, so looking at the rear panel here, we'll start with the USB MIDI connection and the five pin MIDI out and MIDI in. And then we have two extra drum trigger inputs. So they're labeled Tom4 and Crash2, but you can use them with most any major electronic drum trigger and add new pads onto your kit. Then we have our left and right main outputs, obviously to connect to a speaker, and then an aux input. So this is where you can plug in, for instance, an MP3 player and play along to your own music. And then finally, a headphone output. Now I want to show you one of the best features of this module, which is the ability to take a USB thumb drive, load your own sounds onto it, and put them into the module. All right, so now we have our USB thumb drive plugged in the side here. And the first thing we're going to do is load our sample into the module. So we'll go to Menu, and we'll press the Down button until we get to USB Memory, Enter. And then on Sample Load, we'll press Enter. And this lists all the samples I have on my card. I just have one here called Keys Loop. So I'll press Enter to load that one more time. And now it'll start loading it. All right, so now the sample is loaded in. Now I'll show you how to change the sound on the drums in your drum kit. So we'll press Menu again. And on Voice, we'll press Enter. And now we're going to hit whatever drum we want to edit. And you see the drum changes at the top of the menu here. So I'm gonna to go to Tom 3. And to change sounds, you just scroll the wheel to select a different sound. So I'm gonna scroll all the way back until we get to the beginning. And we'll see, there's my keys loop sound. So let's see what it sounds like. Excellent. And that's all you need to do to load a sample onto the drum. And now I'll show you one more cool feature. If you scroll down in this mode, there's a setting called Mode, and one of the modes is the Loop Mode. And this will play the sample over and over again after you hit it the first time, and then when you hit it a second time, it will stop. Okay, those are a couple of my favorite features on the new Elisis drum modules. If you have any more questions, please go to elisis.com. And this has been Dan. Thanks for watching.